Greetings. I am Dr. Shubhankar Chakraborty. I am a pediatric and a neonatal surgeon with Bhagirathi Neotia Hospitals, Newton. So we all have heard of the term called microsurgery, which is a colloquial term for you know laparoscopic or thoracoscopic surgeries, which basically are minimal access surgeries. In these types of surgeries, you don't make big incisions on the chest or the abdomen, but rather you make small incisions with a small axis and you put in instruments inside. And with a camera, you visualize your target organ and operate. So, this principle of surgeries have got much more benefits over conventional open surgeries. Them being, you know, the invasion of tissues are less, so there is quicker recovery and quicker return to normal life. You know, you can there is much less pain. The child, the patient can be discharged quickly. So, we all would like to incorporate these principles in pediatric surgery as well. So, then came a subset of doctors, subset of surgeons who actually, you know, endorse a laparoscopic and thoracoscopic surgery over the conventional open surgeries, which is called, you know, pediatric minimally access surgery, minimal access surgery or pediatric laparoscopic surgeons. So, this is so much more beneficial uh, with regards to, you know, proper visualization and better surgeries. You can operate better and you're only limited by technical factors like the surgical capabilities of operating with, you know, laparoscopic instruments and by you know, good visualization cameras and with slow practice and good training from places, you slowly mature into good pediatric laparoscopic surgeon and then that becomes your first line of management, first line of surgery rather than open surgery which basically turns to be a, you know, backup. So, uh, it's important that the child who undergoes a laparoscopic surgery, you know, is monitored very well during the operation because you need to have very good pediatric anesthetists who monitor the carbon dioxide gas that's given in and that's taken out and all these principles. So your child needs a very good pediatric anesthetist. And also with regards to the instruments, they must have very good, you know, very delicate instruments to naturally work with delicate tissues of the body. And, you know, surgeons also principally, they need to be very akin to working in small working spaces with very low carbon dioxide pressures. And, you know, you must have visualization of target organ, do very proper dissections. And as we have seen over the times, as we do more and more laparoscopic surgeries, there is a definite and, you know, straightforward advantage of doing minimal access surgery. So, pediatric laparoscopic surgeons, they need this kind of setups, like the one we have here at Bhagirathi Neotia. They have got very good, you know, laparoscopic instruments, they have got very good technicians who can you know help you out in troubleshoots have got very very good pediatric anesthetists and of course in the untoward incident that the child may really require a post-operative intensive care this hospital has got very good intensive care facility so if you are thinking about a surgery which can be done in a laparoscopic setting but laparoscopic procedure you opt to you know think about places like here where you have got the first line surgery to be a minimal access surgery so it is definitely beneficial for your child and we have seen patients with you know perforated appendix and all who very quickly became better just because you could give a thorough washout in the abdomen by using laparoscope you can have a proper visualization and we perform so many kinds of surgeries laparoscopically like appendicectomies and gallbladder surgeries we do orchidopexies we do hernia surgeries we can do fundoplications we can do hypertrophic pyloric stenosis surgeries, all this kind. We can do pyeloplasties, the kidney surgeries. All this can be done laparoscopically. So with that, I would like to finish my talk and good wishes for your family. And as I always say, it's only the leaders and the best for kids. Thank you.